Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. This is a mid-month of March 2021 love and general opportunity reading for you Libra. As usual, I hope you are doing well. I hope you're fine. I hope you're safe. I hope you're feeling great wherever you are right now. This is for you. This is the mid-month of March 2021. What is the love opportunity, love messages, and general opportunity for all of the beautiful Libra friends out there? What can I get for Libra, please, okay? Before I start, Libra, I would like to thank you for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the subscribe button and the bell, please do it now if you are interested and if you are keen. And if you would like to further support my channel, Libra, all of the details that you need to know is down in the description box below. Check out the website. We have uploaded the Pisces New Moon. It's happening tomorrow. So if you're interested to check out the rituals, the affirmation, and how to connect with the Pisces New Moon, the blog is up in the website www.sunshine-tv.com. This is me. My introduction is done. So let's start with your reading. Okay. So there's going to be a love reading in here and general opportunity reading for you, Libra. This is the next two weeks. This is a mid-month reading for Libra. What is the message for you? Okay. Let's start with the moon card in reverse. You've got a six of cups and a five of pentacles in upright position you're quite stuck in a soulmate connection the moon card you could be dealing with a cancer you could be dealing with a scorpio pisces and capricorn taurus or virgo um it's been for some of you six it's been six or five years or it's been you know a five to six months um breakup or separation or, you know, you have not been able to find a compromise, a talking point with this person. Um, the moon card, the six of cups, the five of pentacles. It seems to be you're feeling stuck and you're feeling like you cannot get out of this sorrow, of this pain, of this unfinished business. Uh, someone that's really dear to you, six of cups. It could be the father of your kids, the mother of your kids. Um, you could have, it's possible that you shared a pet or you, sh you shared very nice memories with this person. It's a love reading. Okay. It's a love reading who they made a huge impact in your life. They're quite important to you. They're very close to your heart. Could be an ex. It could be someone you dated who you have grown closer to this person. You're quite sad that this person, they have disappeared. They have left you. You break up or separated and in the month of march 2021 you're still feeling blue that you know it's already the third month of 2021 and you haven't heard from them you're wondering how they are are they still upset with you what's their feeling towards you this lingering sadness and um you know there's a key all right this this sadness this feeling blue that you have that you are feeling um, Libra, it is something that you could get up and you could really counter, okay? Because um, it's making you feeling stuck and you're not produ productive, okay? Uh, this is Pentacles. Um, it's a, it's a, you could be dealing with Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Pentacles is something tangible. Pentacles is effort, action. It's something that you could measure. So it is a message that, look, Libra. I know that you've been hurt or you're sad or feeling blue, but if you stay this way, if you stay aloof, if you stay in this darkness and you don't pick up the key and open the door, you're losing time, okay? You're losing time for yourself. You're losing time to meet other people. You're not being productive, okay? It's been three months. It's been five months. It's been six months. Um, it's time to really look after yourself. Pick up the key. Pick up the key and open the door and you will see a whole new world of opportunity around you. Friends, family, career. Open up. You know, open up to the possibility that this person is not available for you. This person is not your person. This person is not interested with you. If there's something in here that you can control, it is your thought. It's your feelings. You are the supplier of your... In this reading, I really feel like 
you're supplying more low vibe energy into your sadness okay be productive you know don't stay too much inside the room go for a drive if it's safe but you have the key to move on a key to let go a key you have the key to the answer you have the answer you have the key you have everything in you to to kind of move on or to stand up and chin up and to you know to pull yourself together okay the key is you all right so that's quite heavy the second reading is that you've got a pipe page of cups it seems to be this is like an x reading you know because you've got a six of cups so you've been together for quite some time or there's a very confirmed relationship between the two of you something official because the second reading this is this is like someone you dated someone you dated someone you've been romantically linked it could be happening right now uh page of cups this is a very sweet message it's unexpected okay page of cups the king of pentacles the two of pentacles um it's a message from someone it's an opportunity to connect with someone again it's a cute message it's a caring message it is a sweet message from someone someone you like someone who makes you feel blush you know page of pentacles the two of pentacles the thing with this person or this message is that it turns you on but it doesn't provide security you know it always makes you feel on off on off you know if they're around you feel complete if they're not around off, or if they're not messaging you you feel incomplete you feel like you've always in a guessing game this person is not ready to commit yet okay um the knight of wands the page of pentacles the eight of wands they're just in for a casual connection something fun something spur of the moment so don't expect too much all right um you've already been disappointed um by this person or i don't think they are a player they're simply having you know they're having their moment to flirt to connect with you fun times it's nothing serious but there's nothing really destructive as well they don't mean to hurt you they, they want to be friends and flirt with you they're not really into that mindset to have a steady relationship. It's just fun, casual, flirting, all about fun. Um, I don't see this person very taking advantage of you sexually or something. It's just fun, you know. Maybe this person in the past, they were, because the Page of Pentacles in reverse, the Eight of Wands, maybe this person, they've come, they've come out of a very messy or very toxic relationship. That's why... They are, they are stepping out of their comfort zone. Because I really feel like this person is just getting ready. This person is starting to starting to open up with love and romantic again. It is their first time for some of you. So check the history of this person. What they, went, what they went through in the past. That past is not totally healed. They're not completely ready for a serious commitment. But they're definitely ready to... Um, to get to know you to explore you and them okay there's something there's something wonderful there's something giggly there's something a swoon um so it's more of take this person and the energy and the attention that they bring towards you as something that's fun something 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 that will keep you busy and inspired okay and then um the last reading is you've got a four of cups in upright position you're waiting for an approval i'm really feeling like this could be an approval from your promotion from your boss from your team leader something of a something of a managerial position for some of you it's a position it's a work thing four of cups you are considering to be noticed to be promoted you're looking for support and um, you're quite sad that you're not getting the support. It's been so long. Some empty promises was given to you. Um, King of Cups. The Page of Wands. Yeah, you're not getting good news. The Seven of Wands. Look, um, I really feel like if you've been in this role or in this company or in this team for quite some time and you're not feeling inspired or you're not feeling productive, you're not feeling 
you're not feeling supported, it's time to look into other opportunity. Um, I really feel like you have a heavy heart. Connect with the people around you at work or you're not you're no longer so productive and creative with this kind of work if that's the case it's it's just all for the money you know it's not giving you that kick that inspiration to do the work or something are you looking for something new then it's time to really roll your sleeve and find your next adventure in terms of your work and career okay don't just sit and be sad don't be don't just sit and sad find the fire that will give you the courage to look for a new job, to be excited again to work. Find that inspiration to be excited to work again or to find work again. Because your inspiration is that if you find work, you probably get more pay. You probably get to know more people and you'll be more productive. You'll feel brand new. Okay, do it. Do it. If you're feeling like I need some change, do it. No one can help you but you. All right, and then you've got here the page of swords okay there is a surprise visit okay there is a person who would who would surprisingly call you or visit you um you know before you actually i think there was a misunderstanding or something didn't um didn't work out between the two of you misunderstanding miscommunication they will surprise they will they will call you surprise surprise call surprise visit surprise appearance reappearance um before you go and hug and kisses you better really start the conversation by clearing all of the misunderstanding the negative vibe in the past make sure that you talk about the past issue and you understand why you did that why the, why they did that you talk about the issue compromise and you know you know ask for an apology or maybe receive an apology and close it off before you actually because i think you'll jump into being okay again without talking about the real issue make sure that the, the wounds it's been it's been talked about that pain that hurt because it will reoccur okay so talk about the issue and then kiss and make up seven of cups in reverse you are into a decision making Ooh, the star card the world card okay wow again this is another energy libra where you're really looking into changing something something about work something about a lifestyle you are also looking into traveling ascending you know traveling moving one place to another you are escalating yourself above high you know you're aiming for something big Go for that because the universe got your approval. You know, look at that. The star card, the world, the wheel of fortune. You are in luck, my friend, whether it is a business venture. Um, I'm really getting like a proposal. Um, whether you choose to find love or you focus on your career or finances, um, it will follow. Okay, love will follow you. If, if you find a new job, there's love opportunity in there because you'll meet a new people, new person, new set of friends, new acquaintances. Well, if you look for love in, you know, you will be more happier and you'll be more productive. So whatever you choose, the universe will approve for you. So the world is your oyster. It's just you. You just really need to push the button. Okay. So you got the universe approve your requests. So shine. Look at that. Shine you know, escalate, fly, soar high, okay? Um, if you're going to do some business, it's better you do it on your own. Like, be solo. You know, it's like the eagle, you know. It, the, the eagle flies so high and they're always solo. You know, it's you, If you're going to do something, be quiet, be solo. And then when things, you know, is confirmed and where you're soaring high or achieving, that's where you share the success. But if it's not yet to confirm, keep quiet of your plan. It might be jinx, okay? So this is you. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thanks for being here. It is a great reading. Good luck to you in your next two weeks. Check out the website. Check out the blog. Check out the Instagram account. Connect with me there. I'll see you soon, guys. Have a great week. Bye-bye.